Okay, so in this video, I'm going to be talking about transcription, which is the process of turning DNA into RNA. So we're going to start off with a little template strand of DNA. And you're going to have a negative 35 to negative 10 region. Um, you're going to have a coding region and the other region would be called the promoter region so transcription its first step is initiation which means that transcription factors right here between the negative 35 and negative 10 um, location Tell the RNA polymerase, right here, you see, they tell the RNA polymerase to bind to this promoter region you see right here. And so what the RNA polymerase does is it, it's what converts our DNA to RNA. And it's kind of cool because it opens the helix on its own and it doesn't need any other enzymes to do that. So once it reaches right here the coding region which is usually I think it's marked by AUG it begins copying this DNA segment beginning at the 3 prime end and and moving towards the 5 prime end and so as it as it moves through this little coding region you got mRNA that's beginning to get produced out here. And so um, the RNA polymerase is going to continue to travel until, until it gets to a stop codon, which there's lots of other ones, but there's lots of stop codons, but we'll just say whatever this is right here is a stop codon. So um, it's, that's also called the terminator sequence. And so now you have your little se sequence of RNA, which is made up of what are called introns and exons. And so exons, like this right here, the exons have um, like the material you want, and introns are kind of just like they're kind of old material that isn't very helpful so the next thing that happens is uh, splicing and so you have a spliceosome which is going to get rid of these en introns and keep the exons so it kind of takes this little segment and you'll have the exon right here and it like basically pinches off the intron and then you're left with the exon right next to it. And these exons basically end up combining together. There's the other exon. Here's the intron. And so basically you end up getting exon to exon to exon. Now that you have all your useful information, a 5' prime cap is attached to the 5' prime end. And what this does is basically it just helps your um, the mRNA move outside of the nucleus into the cytoplasm. Um, that's pretty much its only use. And then also a poly A tail is added to the other end. And basically all that does is it protects the mRNA once it's out in the cytoplasm from getting digested by digestive enzymes in the cytoplasm. And that's transcription right there.